Rescued by the jaws of life, a mother and her three-year-old son found themselves trapped late last night after police say the mother swerved to avoid a pickup truck that had pulled out of in front of her. The driver of that truck took off afterwards. It happened on Nacogdoches Road, and as the night team's Jaffney Gray reports, the family of the victims hopes the person responsible does the right thing. To not to been there, it, it, it was very hurtful. And um, I just don't wish that on nobody. Gwendolyn Cox says she was in shock when she got the call from University Hospital. Her daughter, 28-year-old Brittany Washington, and her grandson, 3-year-old Elijah Johnson, were in a hit-and-run accident that nearly ended their lives. San Antonio police say Washington was driving her car when a driver of a black pickup truck pulled out in front of her. Trying to swerve out of the way, she lost control, hitting a pole on the side of the road. Firefighters had to use the jaws of life to rescue them. No one wants to wake up in the morning and hear about their uh, son as much as his son's mom, both uh, tragically in a vehicle they can't get out of. Elijah's father, Melvin Johnson, says he was devastated as he rushed to the hospital. And you see him on the, on the bed with all the blood all over him. You're just hoping for the best outcome. Both Washington and Elijah sustained serious injuries. However, Elijah has yet to wake up. You no, know, his face is all swollen. And the head's big, it's, it's not right, uh, but he's pushing. Just like his mother, Johnson says his son is a goofball with a loving soul. He's a funny dude, he's a very fast, energetic, big heart, always smiling. The family says they are beyond frustrated with whoever was behind the wheel of that black pickup truck. This driver hit them and didn't stop. Didn't even think that uh, she had a kid in the car and just, didn't have no value for their lives. And though they forgive them, they can only pray they do the right thing and turn themselves in. Like it's not our judgment. You know, he has to answer for his wrong doings. He got someone else he has to answer to. Now, after the driver of that black pickup drove away from the scene, police later found a similar black pickup just a few blocks away. However, they're still investigating if it's the same truck. They're also asking for your help. If you have any information that can lead to an arrest in this case, you're urged to call police as soon as possible. Daphne Gray, KSAT 12 News.